For the Beaver Radio Network, I'm Brian Schultz. BSU men's basketball team opened up the season with an exhibition game this past weekend at uh, Northern Iowa. Open up the season for real this Friday. Joined by one of two seniors on this team, Dylan Floyd out of Palm Springs, California. What is different uh, about the team this year from last year? Um, well, we definitely lost a lot of seniors last year. Uh, it's just me and Brock. We're uh, the two seniors. I think uh, this year we have a lot, a lot of athleticism I think uh, we can really be a good transition team because we have some really like athletic guys. Uh, there's a lot of talent on our team, I think. What uh, What did you guys learn about yourselves in the exhibition game? Um, well, we still have a we we have a lot of new guys, so I think just coming together. I think we're doing a good job with that. Uh, I mean, it, it's a process, but I think we're we're definitely getting a lot better. How has your role changed uh, from last year to this year, knowing that you guys graduated a whole lot of experience? Well, uh, I'm definitely being called upon uh, for being a leader, like for the team. Uh, I mean, we lost Max, uh, Zach, and Jake, and uh, I mean, just overall, just being more of a leader, going from uh, being a, like a six man or on the bench to now being a starter, it's a big step. You guys, one of the seniors you lost was Zach Nareen, a guy who could just eat up minutes in the post mm -hmm. if he stayed out of foul trouble, that is. Um, who is your big frame, big body presence inside the paint this year? Uh, well, it's going to have to be uh, me, uh, one of our new guys, Jelani, or I'd say probably Ben Best. I think uh, we have a good core in there. You're a whole lot skinnier than Zach was. Uh, <laughs> how can you use what tools you do have uh, inside the paint where it's a flat out war? Uh, just knowing how to use my body, I think. Just learning how to use my lower body because, I mean, I'm not as big as Zach was, but I think I can hold my own in the post. Brock Lutz is a guy who can create all on his own. How long does it take uh, some of these young guys and new guys to, to kind of learn how he manages a game and how he can distribute the ball the way that he does? Uh, I think that's just getting to know him, uh, just on and off the court, I think, uh, through practice, just understanding his game and understanding what type of shots he likes to get and stuff. Being from Palm Springs, what led you here? Uh, honestly, when I came on my visit, everyone was just really nice to me. I, I talked to my dad about it. We just thought it was a good feeling here, and I just chose to come out here. It was a good experience to travel the country a little bit. What do you like the most about the Northern Sun Conference? Uh, honestly, I like the competition. I think there's, I see, a, I've seen guys uh, go overseas. I think it's one of the, it's one of the highest competing conferences in the nation for Division Two. Crown College uh, opens up the the real season for you this Friday. It's a non-conference game. Uh, you're at home for the next seven. What does that mean for a college athlete to be at home for seven straight games and not have to get on a bus and not have to miss class? Well, it's de it's definitely a good feeling. Just seven straight home games. It's uh it's really nice to be able to play in front of the fans and just at home. Best of luck to you. Thank you very much.